All right, guys. I just uh, finessed the uh, Uber Eats. Got myself some free McDonald's. The guy never hit me up back, so I'm gonna munch out. It's been like, I think like five or six months since I've been on YouTube. I definitely have a lot of explaining to do. Some of you guys might miss me. Some of you guys probably don't even care. I don't care. I'm just trying to get back on this shit. Because everyone, oh, my close friends keep telling me to get back on it. So I'm like, okay. If I get back on it, then I have to make another video about why I've been ghosting you guys for like the past five to six months. And to start off with, I think I stopped around like May or April. And from then on, my life has been strange. One of my close homies, O Trap Star, passed away in May. 1% after that got back together. We became all good friends again and realized how much life is valuable. Once you lose a really close friend, you realize how valuable life and time is. And after that, I realized how much time I need to put into my life. So from realizing your friend dying and realizing that like all you have in this life is time and every day you have to work hard and work hard, I did everything I could. So I started working hard. I do a lot of different things on the side and it's going good. I'm making sales off Coffin Club. I'm, I'm vending every fucking week out here in Miami, South Florida, selling clothes, selling merch. I have my whole rack of clothes right there. Every week I buy new racks of clothes. I just don't post on YouTube no more because I feel like my audience died out a bit. And on my side, it's for the fact that um, I let girls ruin my energy throughout the years. So I ended up not focusing on my career and instead focusing on my work. I never had anybody tell me like, yo, you should focus on yourself instead of girls because everyone around me wanted to focus on girls. So yeah, I lost myself on a bunch of bullshit. But um, the past five, six months, I've been working out. I've gone to the gym literally every single day. I've gained from 134 pounds to 145. And my goal is to go to 150 or 160 and get this shit back on my motive, you know? And yeah, um, I literally just came back from the arcade. I was with my boy Foss, Chris, and Slog. Um, they're both artists down here from Florida, both blowing up crazy as fuck and punk scene and rap scene. And one of them owns like a really big ass brand called Ross Brand. You guys probably have heard of it. So Fago, uh, DC The Dawn, um, a bunch of like rappers that are like, upcoming wear his shit. Wearing literally like $1,200 shoes right now. Shout out Dior. Um, I've been throwing shows lately. I've been fucking making moves and banging like crazy. That's why I haven't been on YouTube because I've found another way to make money. But I don't want you guys to think that I have given up on you guys. I have just been working on myself and figuring out my life. I was living at a mansion for a whole year. It was just filled with creatives working together to create music, movies, videos, content. It was a fucking trap house. <laughs> it's non existent anymore. But it was a fucking trap house. And I lived with like dealers and this and that. And like, I learned like a lot of shit. Crazy life. Miami lifestyle? <laughs> Insane. Fucking uh, Scarface? I evolved and changed a lot from the past year and a half since 2020. I feel like 2020 was one of those years where you just stepped into a whole other dimension and life just changed. So, yeah, um, I made a lot of huge connections and um, I'm really plugged in with like millionaires and uh, I'm literally millionaires. So, I feel like I've made that move and I did it. <sighs> it's insane. But, I'm going to make this a short video. The reason why I ghosted was to focus on myself and build my empire. My triple seven channel is doing whatever, but the page on Instagram went from literally 4,000 followers to now it's about to reach 70K in almost a few months. And by the end of the year, which is two, two more months left, I'm gonna have it by 10K for sure, like this. And I've had Tribute Red repost my stuff. I've had literally, um, Polo G, like, like my shit, Ken Carson, like, I've had a lot of famous rappers already liking my shit, reposting my shit, buying promo posts, buying this and that, and my goal on that is just to, uh, teach artists tips to, uh, improve their music, make posts on news that's going on in this underground scene and the mainstream scene, and just, uh, overall, a media platform, which is what 777 is. But now, 
it has expanded into a show business. Um, I'm in my second show now. My first show, Fall Bash, with a few other of my um, teammates. Through we sold already, we sold 200 plus tickets, which was like two thousand dollars, and we all split it in half, which was at least like 600 each. Um, I literally cashed out, bought the oars, I um, paid off bills. I'm living life. Um, I'm ready to start vlogging again skateboarding whatever whatever you guys want I literally um, get sponsors from weed businesses all over the world that want me to smoke their shit for YouTube and I guess people like that and I have subscribers that are on my shit because of the weed scene but I want to focus more on skateboarding or designer clothing or any I, I just have so many ideas and I do so many different things and hobbies that I like but I love vlogging everything that I do throughout the week throughout the day and the weeks or whatever so I'm gonna focus on that and whatever you guys want me to do, whether it be like thrift shopping, buying designer shoes, spending a rack at like the mall, I have money for it, I have everything. Um, or just more skating videos, or just more like rapper, chilling with rappers and shit. Just let me know down in the comment section below and I will work on that. But for now, this is a video just to let you guys know that I love you guys and I'm back and I'm better than ever before. I worked on myself. I said fuck all these dumb assholes out here in Miami because I know that means shit. Um, yeah, I'm focused on myself now. I don't give a fuck no more. I just want to fucking make money. I think this is the end of the video. And um, this guy never hit me up back for his food because I do also Uber Eats on the side, which is like, I don't really do it unless like I'm bored as fuck, but yeah. <laughs> I mean the bro's food. All he ordered was literally fries, like, what a salty ass, sweaty ass dude. Hope you guys enjoyed uh, my little uh, rant. I'm back. I'm making a video soon again. I'll probably drop it next week after this video. So <laughs> if you want to keep up with my life, oh my god, I'm outside. <coughs> Follow me on Instagram at Skater Montez. Follow my brands, Coffin X Club, and Triple Seven Official. That's all I ask for y'all. So. Shall love, I'm fucking back and better than ever before, bitches. Yeah, uh, and uh, y'all stay beautiful because you guys are the future. Gang shit.